Mm. I'm getting like a, a feel, especially with the like, you know, the embers dressed up as the birds, like of M. Night Shyamalan's The Village. Like, you know, don't leave the village, don't leave the nest. The guards seem pleased. Clever scruff sticking with us. I can hold that back for you. Leave them alone, they're one of us now. Yeah, one of us. And we all share bags and things. Why are you upset from my bag? Back off. Okay, we need a key. Um, this way just leads back to the cage. Let's go up, and then if there's nothing up, then we'll go to the right. Hello. The stranger wanted Emperor's attention. Being careful uh -huh. not to speak too loudly. Here we go, now we're finding out the truth. You should get away from here while you still can. But birds protect. You can't trust the birds. But birds protect. I've heard there's another campfire in the marsh. Well, that's where I'm going if I can find a way down. Mm-hmm. So we have to find a way down to the marsh. Jump! No, I can't jump. Okay, anything leading down this way? Nope. So we have to find another bird cage to take us down to the marsh. So let's go this way. Oh no, where have our little friends gone? Right, bird brain. The guard squawked. Stand back, don't come any closer. Why? Nothing down there but sadness and turning forlorn. Go see the Forest King. He'll set you straight. Hmm. We're already pals. Got your first feather, I see. Best prove yourself, Scruff. Stand watch here. Promise you won't let anyone pass. Alright. I promise. You, yeah, you gotta do what you gotta do. I'll just stand right here. And not go down these steps. Ha! <laughs> bird and brain. They didn't like deceiving the birds. But what choice did they have? And it was pretty easy to deceive him. I just showed him they a feather. They rest in that place forever. They had to keep going. Exactly. We have to keep going. We still have hope. 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 Oh, there's our friend again. Hey, you. Yeah, oh, yeah, help beat the dash. Let's see what we got. Ember found the wondrous diary. The oily smell of frogs. They know more than they will say. They watch me watching them. So, could this be the marsh? Okay, I see the guy over there. I do want. I want to come. Ember hurried that. away from the birds. The mist hung close to Ember, hiding them. Mm -hmm. The forest king seemed frightened. The birds crew Ember would rather risk turning Oops. forlorn than become like them. Ahead, there would be others to help, and maybe a way to move on. You're right, um, Ember. I feel like we made the right decision by leaving. Dragonfly. Hello. The traveller seemed distressed. I'm sure it's fine. They'd be okay. But it's been a while since. It's my fault. Uh oh. What happened? Okay, I don't want to go into there ever. Hello. There's also another wanderer's journal thing over here. Yeah, I love the little details, like the fish jump in and the, and the frogs. Dusk brings the longest shadows. The lanthorn comforts me. Soft melodies from home. The wild things listen. Yellow eyes and graying trees. Then let's go back up and see what our little orange friend is doing up there. He's probably just gonna run away, but I don't I don't wanna accidentally skip something. 
So I imagine that that door over there is like the the marsh with the mist, and that's where everyone was getting lost. Okay, remember to press B to dash. Run, come here. Hey. Ah. Okay, so we do have to go this way. The bridge is out. Jump, 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 jump. And let's go into the mist. Let's take a screenshot first. Hmm, let's see. Because there, if you notice above the doorway, it wasn't a flame anymore. It was like it looked like a lotus leaf. So I guess that's kind of showing the new, the difference between the areas. Hello, Pokeball. Hi. The traveler whispered quietly, "No matter where I go, I always end up here. Hmm. No matter where I go, always here." Don't worry, we can solve this puzzle. Even though I have to say, I feel like these type of puzzles are always my worst, my least favorite type of puzzle, where, you know, you are basically, well, most of the time, just guessing which way to go. But at least there is a map. Can I do anything to it the map? Like uh -huh. map. Okay, this. But I can move the pieces. So then we want to go up. A new route. Or we can only go up. And then to the left. It was oh. the same place as before. But how? Yeah, you're right. How? So. But is this new? This is new. Good. A ah. eerie scene. Like a moment frozen yeah. in time. Um. I guess we take. Oh, hang on. This we must have to take back to the map, but I, there's a, there is a another journal up here. Look. Hidden away was a scrap of journal. There are memories here, bound in rock. I hear their voices echo in the ancient stone. I find footprints by the cinders. A makeshift, makeshift camp. camp. Good. So, yeah, we must have to take this back, put it on the map, and then. Once we've finished the map, we can, you know, then move through. So actually, this isn't too bad. Um, no friend. Wait for me. So then, do I go back this way to get back to the map? Yes. Okay, cool. Uh huh. So. We're in the map room. Cat doesn't do much. Gradually, more of the map was revealed. Okay, so we can go to the. It looks like a compass room if we go to the right. Yes. A section of bridge had somehow been ripped from its foundations. This is cool. I like this. Maybe we're supposed to go down there then. I thought this was—I thought this was the same um, same room. Uh -huh, we can go down, but we can't go up. Okay, so this and then then here and then down. I guess it's the only option. There should be a new room here. It is. It was like the map had been broken on purpose. Another piece. Take that back to the map room. By going this way, and then I also want to get another screenshot this way, and then I think we have to go straight over. We 
out back at the map room, okay. So then if we put that in there, then it looks like we need one more to get out. So we just need to go straight up and over. And there are secrets we can get, look, there are more journals if we want to get them, but I don't think I'm gonna bother too much with the journals. The mist revealed a secret place. Was it hidden on purpose? Hmm. Let's see, can we somehow Hi there. You made it out. The stranger spoke. You know, part of me didn't want to be found. I said some things I shouldn't have. And now I'm lost. But it's too late. Don't worry, I'll save you. Okay, so this looks like we can uh -huh. So we have to put the the statue on there and then move it across, I think. The statue looks a little bit like, is it Eve from Wally? You know, the little white robot thing. Yeah, I, yeah. Okay, so pull that up. Then put you on here, lower it back down. Oh. Like this. And then go down. And put you on the pedestal. Then we go in there. Maybe this is where the map piece is. I would assume so. Melody cave, the source of sadness. Oh, another big feather. The skeleton looked peaceful. Held tightly in its hand was a red feather. Huh, so is this where the birds attack? A lantern, sacred instrument with the power to move the world. Interesting. Uh oh. The statue spoke, just as it once moved the hearts of the forlorn. The instrument you now hold has the power to move the world around you. Okay. Another before you took great effort to hide it deep within this riddle. So, can we use the haunt? Hmm. Alright. Yes. Can I move? move ah, that's cool. Might as well get this whilst we're here. Ember found a scrap of journal. I heard them coming. The snap of a twig, a flutter of birds, a figure dashing through the undergrowth. Another, Another like, like me. me. Move this back. And we can get out. Cool, that's cool. Longish loading screen. Okay, I do just want to go back. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything we can move. 
Also doesn't look like there's anything worth going up there for, but okay. So we have this horn. Now we can move this over here and get some of this stuff. Hidden inside was the wanderer's journal. Another face at last. A catcher of fish oh, we know him. resting by a pond. We work together, silk and tar and aching fingers. My boat floats once more, though I almost wish to stay. Hmm. Didn't unlock any more map pieces. There was one last place to reach on the map. There was. Question is, how do we reach it? Uh. Like, do we have to? to be right but it works so I'm not going to complain too much and we can move this up maybe that's why it worked because we have the okay and this is the straight one but there must be some somewhere that lets us go up Got up because I've seen a few of the of those like chests up on the tops of cliffs. The pig marsh. Ember felt a great relief to be out of the mist. Me too. Um. Okay, we're in the pig marsh. Ravens are never a good sign. So I guess we probably have to throw that barrel this way. The way through was ruined. Of course it was. By the fog, Ember was sure they heard a rumble. Could that have been a tremendous snore? snore. Let's see. Okay, so I can... What do you want me to do with this? Ah, pull it. Huh, that's cool. It's got some cool mechanics in it. Okay, then we can climb up here. And then... We'll take the slide down. There is our little guy again. He didn't mind getting muddy. The slide was such fun. He is very muddy, though. He do be very muddy. Right, Parker. Sleeping pig. Trotters in the air. They looked happy. Like how I look when I sleep. A sleeping pig. Trotters in the air. They looked happy. Take some screenshots for, for Instagram. Which you can follow by going to at switchindiefix on Instagram. Okay, we have this fruit. I guess I have to throw it at this guy's the eye. was giving off a sickly sweet smell. Oh, it's a mouth, not an eye. The plant looked like it could take a hand off, and it was an ember's way. Well, what am I supposed to do? I gave him the melon. I thought by giving him the melon, he'd disappear. 
Hmm. Wait, am I meant to hit him with something? The net? No, I don't have the net. Or the feather. The plants looked and it was an ember's way. Hmm. Okay. Ah, maybe I'm supposed to give it to the pig? Maybe it'll wake the pig up and the pig will do something to the plant. Let's see. Hello. It's to the pig. Come on. Let's go. Then if I give it to you, then is the pig going to eat you? Get him. Oh. Ember chuckled. The dangerous plant was no match for a hungry piggy. Very cute. Very cute. I do feel a bit bad for the plant now. The wallow. So well, there's our guy. He's running away again from us. Why is he? Why does he keep running away? Uh, whilst I'm here, okay. I'm guessing we have to use this. Yeah, very Legend of Zelda esque to move these blocks. Yeah, and then we can go up there. We have another slide. A hideous odor filled the air. Wow, it's all this. Uh, and suddenly, I... the reason was obvious. <laughs> what oh, TV? Uh huh. We're supposed to do something with the TV. Okay, mm -hmm. all these embers that have died. Pig inhaled a giant snort of air. Wait, what's that delicious smell? Ember shuffled nervously. Other embers fed me treats, but then stopped. Hmm. You feed me now. Okay. It was junk. Maybe the pig would eat some junk. Well, there's only one way to find out. Seems weird junk to uh, having this game now. A light grew in its belly. Surprising, a little sparky, but tingly in the belly. But what I want is what's he want? Something more fruity. Uh huh. Probably the stinky fruit from the. Pig would eat anything. Ember just needed to find more. There's our guy up there again. Look. The pig would eat anything. Can we move? No, we can't move this. Here, eat this. I don't see a light though. I'm a bit worried that the lights aren't working. Fresh, but tastes a lot like mud. Hmm. But what I want is something with more crunch. How about the junk? Would you eat? If Ember could satisfy the pig, they might be more helpful. Uh huh. Okay. Well, there is another journal Inside over here. A secret diary entry. Pink, orange, red, brown, leaves gently dancing to the ground. Crunch, crackle, lovely sound, fall into a giant mound. Lovely little poem there. But not something crunchy. Let's find something crunchy for the pig. Maybe this, maybe... Mm. can go that way. I don't know if that's the way we're supposed to go, but... 
That is the way we have gone. Can't get down there. Maybe the skull is what he wants. The skull was disgusting. Perhaps the pig would like it. Hmm. It would be crunchy. The only question I have is, can I take it through here? Will it go through the world? It will. Dun, 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 dun. I like the music here. Dun, dun, dun. Try this. This was the last thing Ember could find to offer. Crunchy, embery, not much meat, a bit too bony. But what I want is no, no, no. big stomach made an almighty sound. Uh oh. Do you think it's sitting on its poo or its food then? Ember chuckled with relief at the large creature they had been so afraid of. <laughs> but I mean, well, I can go over, up and over. All right, cool. Let's go up and over. Hollow marsh. And just before we get into the hollow marsh, I just want to look at something on the phone. Good. Sweet. <clears throat> Good. So, whoop. Oh, there's a pig again. Something moved beneath the surface. I have a feeling it's the pig. Looks like his ears. There he is. Hello. In a muddy pond, Ember thought the pig Crap. looked a lot less imposing. The pig shouted joyously. The water feels so good on the skin. Join me, morsel. Mm. The pig seemed happy, but Ember wasn't getting too close. I don't blame Ember. I consume whatever people put in front of me. I need some true nourishment, but there's none left here. But so much cooler in this muddy pond, I can finally think. Thank you, Morsel. Not a problem, my friend. I feel like I'm going to be jumping on your head in a second. Or at least rolling a barrel on it. <laughs> Very cute. Um, ah, hi. Cheerily, the stranger said. Don't say much, little friend, do you? Remind me of one of those golem statues. Stood there, mouth open. I like you. <laughs> Seems like someone I'd get on with, too. Oh, oh, oh. So let's quickly have a look around here, and then... We'll throw this down. And then... Yeah, actually, you know what? I saw the campfire up here. Let's... Oh, what's that? A secret? Ooh. Very nice. Well, we can climb down here. And then I'm just going to take a quick, quick break. Uh, and then, yeah, and then we've probably got about one more hour left of the stream. Uh, I just need to contact Bastion to I see if he's... Was inside. If he's streaming straight after me, the or... Is thick. One way blurs into another. Where do I end? Where does the world begin? I cannot see far enough to tell. Yeah, if he's, if he's streaming after me, or if he's... Um... Or if he's planning on streaming later tonight for his birthday. I think he's 24 today. So, yeah, I hope he has a good birthday stream. I'm not sure what he's going to be playing. I don't know if he's going to be trying to get back into Wargroove or trying something new. Campfire lost in the wilderness. It looked long. The ghost said, speak and I will listen. Where am I? This is the Hollow Marsh. 
Fear of hope was consumed before it could flourish. You must not lose hope, or you too will turn forlorn. We're definitely not losing hope, don't worry. Ember thought of those they loved, those they'd left behind. I want to help others. There are others lost along their journey. Find them and I will guide them. The forest king watches the doors. So you're still watching the doors. The campfire will light the way. Okay. Find those who are lost. Bring embers to the fire. That's what we shall do. Travel wisely. Return if you have lost your way. Okay, so I guess when he says return if you've lost your way, it means that um, he will tell us where the other guys are hidden. So good. So like I say, guys, I'm just going to take a quick break uh, and then I will be back for an extra hour of uh, the last campfire. Really enjoying it so far. I hope you guys are enjoying it too. And like I say, I'll just be back in one second. Mm -hmm. 